Let them speak. Patterns 38. Please repeat. I spend time verb ing. One, two common questions. How long do you spend verb ing? How much time do you spend verb ing? How long did you spend studying there? I spent three hours studying there. How much time did she spend cooking? She spent 30 minutes cooking. How many years did she spend teaching there? She spent three years teaching there. Two, how long question equals how long do you spend verb ing. How many days did he spend working there? How many days did he work there? That's all sentence. One, that's all sentence. I only verb that. I just verb that. This is all sentence. I only verb this. I just verb this. Is that all he ate? Did he only eat that? Was that all he did? Did he only do that? Is that all she told you? Did she just tell you that? Is this all he cleaned? Did he only clean this? That's all I like. I only like that. That will be all he wants. He'll just want that. Two, in the past and future tense, please note. This is all he showed her. That was all he showed her. This is all she will sell. This will be all she will sell. Whatever sentence. One, a common adverb, whatever you want, whatever you like, as you like, what you like, as you want, what you want. Do whatever you want. Do as you like. 
She did whatever she wanted. He watched whatever he wanted on TV. Two, note the variations. Whatever. She ate whatever they had. Whenever. He talks to her whenever she comes. Whoever. I'll give it to whoever likes it. However. He'll finish it however he wants. Wherever. You can sleep wherever you're comfortable. Please answer. Did he take whatever you gave him? How much time did you spend eating there? Can I go whenever I feel like going? Is that all he decided to bring? Was that all he let you bring with you? Will you be there whenever he calls? How long did you spend teaching there? How many hours did she spend talking to him? Wasn't that all she needed to tell him? Is it okay to sell whatever I want? Isn't that all he'd like to do? Did she fix whatever he broke? Wasn't that all he told her to buy? How long did you spend talking to them? Did you spend an hour explaining it to them? When will you spend time playing with him? Is that all she knew? Shall I tell that to whoever comes here? It's a good thing sentence. It's too bad sentence. One, that is optional. It's a good thing that he did that for you. It's too bad that he doesn't feel like doing it. It was a good thing that they let him go there.
It's too bad he doesn't have enough money to do it. It's a good thing that he's been saving a lot of money. It's too bad it's too late to see it. Two, if is commonly used with this pattern in the future tense. It'll be too bad if she's not able to get together with them. It will be a good thing if he tries to contact her. That will be a good thing if he manages to finish it today. The fact that sentence. One, that is optional, but it is generally used. Two, this pattern will make any sentence into a noun. The fact that he is sick is his fault. He talked about the fact that he loves her. He can't accept the fact that it is his responsibility. She bought it despite the fact she doesn't have money. I agree with the fact that he is the best at doing it. Because of the fact he doesn't try, I won't help him. Three, it is used a lot with I like and I hate. I like the fact he was honest with her. I like that he was honest with her. He hates the fact he has to work late. He hates that he has to work late. He's like sentence. He goes sentence. One, this is the same as he said sentence. It is mostly used in the first and third person. He's like, there is no way I can go there. He said, there is no way I can go there. She goes, he didn't give her any money. She said, he didn't give her any money. I'm like, I don't have time to do that. He's like, he isn't going to be doing it. Two, you can't make a question with this, but you can put a question in the pattern. He's like, why should he go there? He asked why he should go there.
I'm like, how much is that going to cost to do? She's like, what does he need to go for? Although sentence. One, this fat pattern is very similar to even though sentence. Although he didn't want to go, he went. She studied with him, although she didn't know a lot of the answers. Although it's more expensive, he decided to buy it. He will try to find it, although he may not be able to find it right away. I hope to go although I can't promise I will make it there by six. He's thinking of meeting her, although he really doesn't feel that well. I'm aware of him, verb ing. I am aware of that sentence. One, this is similar to I know sentence. That is optional. Two, you can use the fact that sentence. I am aware of the fact that sentence. Are you aware that he doesn't want you to go? Was she aware of you coming? When was he aware that you needed to go there? Who was aware of the fact that you weren't home. Is she aware of the fact that he doesn't like her? Isn't she aware of them meeting later tonight? Were they aware of you taking her there? Anything verb, anything to verb. One, the use of some, any follow the same rules we learned in hour 15. Two, this can also be used with anything else. Did he give you anything expensive? Did he give you something expensive? Did you buy something else to give to her? He didn't take anything to eat to school. Will he bring anything else to feed them? Was anything else cheap there? When will he have something to give to me?
Is there something wrong? Wasn't there anywhere else pretty to see? No matter how adjective you are, sentence. No matter how much you verb, sentence. One, instead of much you can use well, hard, long, often. It depends on the adverb you use. No matter how well he does it, she complains. No matter how long he prepares, he won't be ready. No matter how often she asks, I won't be able to help. No matter how hard he tries, they aren't satisfied. No matter how much he explains it, I don't understand. Two, instead of how much, you can use what, where, etc. No matter what he tells you, don't believe him. No matter where he lives, he always goes home on Christmas. He talks to anyone, no matter who calls. No matter when he comes, please call me. No matter how he pays for it, I will be happy. No matter who is late, they'll have to wait. Three, with the adjective instead of am, you can use get or become. No matter how cold it is, you need to go out. No matter how sick you get, I'll keep in touch with you. No matter how mad she became, I try to keep helping her. No matter how hard it is, you should keep trying. No matter how expensive it gets, I've decided to get it. Four, with the noun, many or much is used. Follow rules from hour 15 regarding many and much. No matter how many people come, you have to feed them. No matter how much money he wants to give you, don't accept it. No matter how many cars he has, he won't let me drive any of them. No matter how many jobs he has, he still isn't able to save money. No matter how many times he tells you that it isn't true. No matter how much food he makes, there won't be enough. No
No matter how much beer he drinks, he doesn't seem to get drunk.